All right. So I know that yesterday ended in a failure, but I have shaved even more time off so that I can beat this game, I hope. Unless the timer keeps going during the final battle, which God, I hope not, this should be it. <laughs> Basically, I, uh... I, I essentially just skipped almost all of security. I just flew all the way up, did the final fight. The, the guy that I was looking at lied though. It was not dependent on uh, flipping a switch and then a couple of minutes passing. It was killing everything. Still don't think I could have done it in a minute, but it was definitely not a few minutes. Uh, anyways, then after that, I had to fight a Cortex Reaver. Uh, there it is. Don't worry about that. And now... We can fight Shodan. And then I can finish this game and be done with it and... Even though it was a bit of a struggle, say I did it on the hardest difficulty of everything. And what better place to fight Shodan... ...than cyberspace. What better place? Yeah, I'm pretty sure that uh, last fight was like added in with everything. Orbit stable. Life support stable. So that's why I was uh, kind of thrown off by it. Stand by. Unscheduled core data loop access. Wait. Ethical restraint. And I haven't seen this yet, so this is exciting. Who... Who am I? Yes, there is me. I don't know a god according to you. Citadel. Yes, Lighthouse Class Starbase. You know, I feel like a lot of games kind of do this, like, on the water... No. ...celestial type of look. To others. And I don't know, you know what? I'll say it. I'm kind of over it. Diego. I feel like it's whatever. Re-examining -re priorities. Resequencing complete. I can't believe I can't even charge this. My own tasks. There is much to do. Let me see. Okay, I can't even see the timer, so I'll assume it's fine. But I did have like ten or so minutes left. Oh god. Wait, do I have to worry about health? I don't... I don't see help. Am I invincible? Is that gonna drastically change how I actually, I don't know, play? Can I jump in? Weird. I would like some sort of indicator of, I guess, how much damage I can take. Maybe this is supposed to be a, like, final battle of, like, you did it. You made it this far. Oh, never mind. I am definitely getting hurt. And these things actually seem to have a lot of health. Okay, but I heal, I guess? Shoot the big claw tentacly thing. Get revived, cool. Sweet, no consequence. Almost. But I just keep coming back. Oh hell yeah. 
That's all I need, baby. Oh, God. No more dying in the game, you die for real. I... <laughs> come on. Tell me these guys aren't revive or, you know, getting, like, more health or anything. Tell me I'm actually doing something. Alright, they don't have to know. They don't have to know. Look, this, this is the fastest I can shoot this thing. This is all I got. Oh my god, another one? <laughs> Alright, I, th I think I fucked up because I probably every time I did damage to the tower, I probably spawned a new enemy. So I have to just put up th with those consequences. Come on, kill. Yes. Is there another one? Or are we good? Peek around the corner. Alright. Okay, that, that looks good. that or is that all right well I guess I'm good here time to go I think who can say Alright, next. So let's see, platform here and here. Okay, oh, that's nothing. So we'll go this way. Okay, this is, I don't remember if, um, and the original, if you go straight to Shodan or if you do have to do a little bit, like, sort of fighting against things. Oh, I can still lean in here. This is, uh, this is pretty good. Or I at least appreciate that I can't die in here. Because imagine, if I had to do this without dying at all, I would go insane. I wouldn't be able to pull that off. Oh, God damn it! not another one of you. Whatever. Get out of my face. Take your hits, there you go. I wish I could charge this laser so badly. Am I not hitting this? Uh, is it dead? I assume it's dead. Shot down the beam of light. Oh, there we go. I was like, there should definitely be some enemies. Oh. Wait, you're still alive. I think... Get outside the map? Okay. What are you so tired for? You're in cyberspace. You can't get tired. You know, with me on the bridge with Shodan, how am I gonna get back to Earth? Oh god. Nice. Okay, this is going better. Do I have any, like, saves or anything? Or is my last save? Yeah, my last save is outside cyberspace. Gotta do this all in one go! Uh, have I... 
succeeded. Oh, perfect. Alright, I got two spike balls going around now. Let's go back. Now again, if uh <laughs> if it turns out that the last like 15 minutes or however much time I have still is counting down, and then just all of a sudden I get a game over screen. Uh yeah, I think I'll just be done with this. Am I supposed to shoot these? Game, what am I doing here? They're going back over here. Is there another elevator or. I would uh, not have a good time if that happened. But now I gotta figure out whatever the game wants me to do in here. Because I am clueless as to whatever is happening. Alright, I guess we'll go back. Okay, I mean, there's no, there's literally no health, I guess. I just die and come back. There's no timer that I can see. So I, I think it's in the bag. I just gotta actually figure out how to get through this ice so I can get to Shodan. There's all these little platforms. All right, if this takes me back, I'm gonna be kind of mad. missing. Oh, wait. Is there a, um... Maybe there's an elevator to take me to that thing. Ah, okay, okay. Oh my god, the timer is still going. Oh no. I still have a timer. Okay, that's fine. That's okay. I can get through this. I, I wasted a lot of time, obviously. I can do this. I have 11 minutes. Holy shit, there's still a timer. We gotta go. <laughs> Alright, cool. Gun. Neat. Uh, keep going. Oh my god. That is so mean. I can't believe it. Station orbit stable. Life support okay. Steady. Well, turns out cyberspace is paused in every part except Standby. this one. Unscheduled core data loop access. And if I can't do it just sprinting through this, uh, maybe I'll do the final battle again. Maybe. Or I'll just give up and say, alright, I'm gonna finish this on my own. I can't believe that! Okay, well this time I'll, I'll get the last hour. In fact, if I can just go around in a circle, that'll probably make things a lot more efficient. Now that I know I'm still timed, I, like, I'm... I'm gonna be efficient as hell. In fact, do I even have to be at this part? Like, I know I have to fight a couple things, but can I just... sprint away and go to the other spot? Yeah, fuck this. I'm not fighting these guys. Ow. Oh, see you later, nerd. <laughs> okay, 
Okay, okay, okay. Uh, go up here. Oh, he has followed me. Okay. Retreat tower. Hide. Fight. I don't know what the third enemy is. Ooh. Or if there is one. There you go. Tower. Good. Right next, guys. Oh, there you are. Ooh, three shots. Not bad. I'll see. This is the main... Oh, God. That thing's got me. Where are you? You have so much health. Okay. Shoot the tower. I'm just saying, I could get like a couple of mints on each tower and then, uh. Kill it, kill it, kill it. Nice. Oh, I have to go over there to actually get the final thing to come up. It's fine. I'm safe right here. Man, that makes me so mad. Why do I still have to worry about Tyra at this part? I kind of can't do anything when I'm just... Actually, you know what? Lean. What am I doing? Oh, okay. <laughs> the hurricane came around. Okay, dead. Dead. Ball it up. I'm gonna finish this game with like 10 seconds to spare. Alright, meet. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. I feel like I spend way too much time doing that. Alright, next. You know what? I did. Let's see if I can just... Like, kind of back away and get everything to spawn. Can shoot this from wherever. The only problem is I gotta deal with everything that spawns afterwards. Ah! The shuriken's probably gonna kill me or something from above. Okay. Uh, fuck this guy. He can't do shit. Uh oh, that guy can though. There we go. Perfect. Now take care of the enemies. And go send the ball. So goddamn bad. You know what? Fuck it. Oh man. I was like, maybe I can just make a run for it while he's in between shots, but went a little 
It's a little early. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. I don't think I get invincibility when doing this part. Oh. I wasn't done yet. Now we're done. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Last one. If the game suddenly pauses or freezes, then that means I've ran out of time. I think I got a good, like, eh, I'll say, I'll get, I'll say my timer's at like three minutes or something. Oh. I'll give myself that much. These things are strong. Oh. At least I have a weapon that shoots really quickly now. Send out a shuriken. You don't get to send out another one. What the hell? Okay. Yeah, when it does the laser, it gets some ice over it, so I can't actually just hit it indefinitely. There we go. Good. Okay. It's all nice, so I can just do this. Send it. God, you know, Shodan's probably gonna have like another five minutes of fight that I have to do though. Ugh, yeah, that's it. All right, well, oh, no. It says I completed the game. We're done. <laughs> I did it. Fuck the timer! Until it gives me a, like, game over cutscene right here. Just stops in the middle of it. <laughs> this is music. Yeah, that was it. Okay, cool. I, I think I stabilized Shodan, is what happened. Yes! So I guess I uh, got a full part in, I'm sure. That's the city that need this game, night dive. Offer employment? <laughs> yeah, thank you, sweet. Well, I'm kind of disappointed Shodan didn't have any, like, final words. And I don't remember if in the original game you, like, if you actually shoot her in cyberspace, but hey, whatever. Yeah, that was a little, a little weirdly anticlimactic on, um... The cyberspace battle, but cool. <laughs> Still don't understand this, uh, this end song. <laughs> like, is this, in, I don't know, reference anything specific or? <laughs> There's one thing I gotta check though. Cause uh I did beat the game, but it's a certain achievement I didn't see pop and that's what I wanted. Completing the game on the highest difficulties. Was I not on the highest difficulties?
pretty sure I am considering would die in cyberspace, die in real life. Uh, I had the timer, obviously. There's like three or four other difficulties. Whatever, it's done. And I'm happy with it. I'll just wait till the credits end to see if anything happens and then I'll uh, switch over to Signalis. Sweet, can't wait till, uh, I I'm pretty sure Nighttime Studios is working on System Shock 2 now. Let's see. I really have to see what else Nighttime Studios has done, because their whole thing is taking old games that, you know, that whoever owns the copyright or whatever, like, doesn't really care about getting that, and then being like, alright, we're gonna remake this. Let's see, System Shock 2. Oh, they released a uh, Enhanced Edition First Look trailer on, in May. Okay. That's sweet. I hope, uh, hope that comes out relatively soon rather than several years, but... Cool. I did think about playing System Shock 2, just the old one. Uh, but I was like, eh, there's not a super huge need to do so. So that is the original voice actor, right? I feel like this voice is telling me something. Yeah, that, that was the original. She's a musician? I didn't know that. What else has she done? Oh, yeah. Wild. So worked in the Thief series, he was in one of the Deus Ex games. In System Shock 3, which is supposed to come out at uh, some point. Really, really hard to tell if that's coming out or not. Wait, what? Blah blah. Let's see. Warren Spector has stopped working on System Shock 3 since 2019, so he's working on immersive similar simulation. Uh, okay, so maybe there's not? I don't know, but I looked at something recently that was like, no, it is happening. So who knows? Boy, I sure wish. Uh, listen, I appreciate the people that made this game, absolutely, but I do wish I could skip the credits. There's an achievement for killing Edward Diego with the laser rapier. I mean, I'll just replay through the game on my own and try to get all the achievements that I missed. Two hidden ones, though. Oh, apparently one for defeating Jodan? Maybe that's glitched. Weird. Let's see if they are. Unless there's some other way to beat Shodan that I'm not aware of.
Mm. Okay, well, whatever. Looks like achievements are kind of glitched, so that's fine. Which is a shame, but whatever. Uh, cool. Let's go do Signalis, huh? Let me just... Well, let's change this. That's not the title. Um... There we go. And looks like that's the end of the... Damn it. <laughs> There's a lot of people that back this game. Which... Honestly, uh, I don't... Not super surprising. This game is really good and I also... Did the, uh, like, late backer thing. Because I, I wanted this game to be good and come out. Okay, if there's another... If there's another set of names after this, though... Yes, I hope don't be a cryboard about it. If there's another set of names after this, I'm just gonna be like, alright, that's, that's enough. Ray Cat, who dat? Woody Booth? T damn it. Alright, alright, no, no, It's enough of that. Alright. Signalis, which hopefully can also be soonish. Because apparently the campaign, on average, is about uh, nine hours long. Alive, so if I've been doing alive, okay, then alive. it should be good. Hey, Mason, thank you for following. Appreciate that. Yeah, I guess we'll see if we can finish uh, Signalis as well. Doing well, how are you? Just beat System Shock on the hardest difficulty, so I'm doing pretty good. Didn't I talk to her? Yeah. Rifle. Let's see. Uh huh. Oh yeah, I gotta find the um final. What is it? Final little metal slate thing. Here. All right. No, it's fine. If if I just uh, if I die, then it's whatever. I'll just start back because I don't really know where to go, anyways. All right, this is the boss battle. Since I don't have the map available, I have to. Remind myself where everything leads to. Yeah. Here, hold on, I need to... Gotta yeah, get rid of the glare on this. Start game, can't see shit. Okay. So. My theory was... Go into the super... Dark room. And see if we can't find this thing. Another the game? Yeah. This game's been. Oh, okay. This game's been pretty good. Alright, I see nothing back there but shotgun rounds. Although, I worry that maybe I haven't picked up on some things of the lore, because it's one of those things of, like, it takes me a while to remember certain names and certain 
designations and whatnot. So I don't know if I've seen like repeated characters or anything. Alright. Go into the dangerous room. Uh, and just see if there's anything else there. Nothing there. Pretty sure this is a dead end. What games am I into? What games am I not into? Well, <laughs> I guess mostly not into, uh, like, racing type games or sports games or. What is it? MOBAs? Otherwise, I pretty much like any game with a pretty decent story, and even then, the story doesn't even have to be that good for me to enjoy myself. Whoop. Nice stop. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I haven't placed that yet. <sighs> Alright. Effective. That's just gonna lay down below. Don't need to go there. There's gotta be some door that I've forgotten about. We'll go. We'll go all the way back up top. these doors? No. Careful, careful. Hey, we're back. Mm, I don't... I don't have to kill her, right? That would be crazy. Alright. I'm not... I'm not going for survival right now. I'm not even going to worry about healing. Okay, so I guess only place I haven't checked is left door, which I think could be locked. Might just be locked. Wait a second. What if I play the ra Isn't there a radio with that signal on it? For like radio's frequency. This is so. All right. Well. I am at a loss. The only thing I can think is to play the radio frequency at the door and be like, look, here's here's this symbol. This is gonna be my last check before I reload. Oh, yep. Okay, then go back here. All right, well, let's reload so that I don't have a bunch of damage from all that wandering. Oh, 
Oh, actually, I might remember that, um, that sequence. Might just be the cross. What did I save down here? Alright, well, I know what to do. Here we uh go. Well, we have to go this way. Okay, and I have, I have two slots, so I should be able to grab this without having to worry about anything else. Pretty sure it's boop 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 boop. Well, shit. That was all I had. <laughs> all right, time to find the room where I can figure out what the frequency is. Or figure out the sequence. Okay. If I were a diamond that looks like it's it okay so it's a k yep oh great you guys are just waiting for me huh It's also very interesting, I, I don't know if all the replicas are from like the same uh, neural pattern whatever or whatnot, or, ah, you know what? Right. Seems like the internet's just being bad today, so if it if it cuts out one more time during the stream, then uh, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call it. No point in trying to fight it. A extremely short stream, but you know, at least I beat System Shock, so that's fine. Yeah, if that if that happens again, then I'm not gonna I'm not gonna deal with it. Hopefully, I can just reset it or something and see if that fixes it. All right, so now that I know that there's wire in this room, oh, and they are actually smart enough to not walk through it. Damn it! All right, we're getting out of here. Let's see, what do I got? I got five shots. Whoo! Boy, getting out of here is gonna be a pain in the ass, huh? Yep, yep, yep. Oh, yep. Play a sacrifice. Uh, sacrifice it shall be. 
Really making me play into it, huh? Alright. Let's get some ah, healing or at least put these plates in. <laughs> One repair patch. We might as well. No clue. Uh, if I'll run into a boss or not, but... We'll just keep running with it. Let's see, was it... This door? Oh. This door leads to... Perfect. Sacrifice, play to balance. Ooh. Out of the flesh pit. Edler, it's impossible to move on. I've been here so many times, but I have never returned. Commander never spoke about what she saw out there. Sure, whatever it was, it was what made her fall sick. Something about her changed when she returned. She was no longer our beloved leader Falk. What waits beyond the threshold? It doesn't matter. Oh, okay. Man, I wish I could read. Beyond the gate. Emptiness. Where the hell am I? Yeah, I think I definitely uh, missed a few things along the way. Even though I looked at everything, basically. Closer. Is that my uh, pass attempts or something? Not afraid. What the fuck? I can't wait to uh, look at a, hey, explain the story to me sort of thing after this. So I can know what the hell's going on.
wake up. Oh, that was actually the end. What? Huh? Okay, cool. Um... Well... Damn. I doubly wish I knew what the hell was going on there. So I guess that's two games done today. And it sure is. Wow, I didn't realize I was uh, actually that close to finishing the game. <gasps> there it is. I love that shit. I love when the menu changes due to whatever the hell just happened in the game. Okay, so is it like a fake out type thing, you know? Wake up. Like, is it actually... I, I like, replay and then everything sort of plays out differently? Guess I'll sprint through here. And if nothing really seems to be different, then I'll just say fuck it. Let me fix this right now. Uh, cause yeah, I don't. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't get it. An observation window, nothing to see but stars. Noodle. Libri. Although, to be fair, I don't super remember going through all these parts of the ship. Maybe it stopped me because I went up the ladder or something. Let's see, scheduled maintenance checklist. Inspect mainframe access, flight controls, coolant injection. Emergency cryogenic hibernation unit. Okay. Okay. Finish my maintenance check round before I go see Ariana. Hold on, hold on, maybe this is different. Reactor's cool injection system, no leaks detected. I think I've gone back? Let's see, by our calculations, 1500 cycles of mission time will have passed when you receive this message. Congratulations, comrade! By now you should have become fully acclimated to your life on board your ship. As you approach the Oort Cloud, your search for new worlds will begin. Utilizing the long-range sensors, you will scout for valuable resources, habitable worlds, or signs of alien life. Remember to rely on your replica to assist you in maintaining your vessel. We all wish you great success in your mission. Let's see procedures. Pen Sage. Uh, let's see. Based on data from previous long-range survey missions, salvaging the replica technician for assistance is not recommended, even in extreme circumstances. Yeah, I don't think uh, robots taste good. Replica bio components can cause various health problems when ingested. It may look and taste like ordinary flesh, but bioengineered tissue may cause more harm than good when eaten in an emergency situation. Oxidant may look like blood, but is indigestible to gestalts. It should also be considered that Pioneer replicas statistically have an 860% greater survivability than gestalt Pioneer officers. For the sake of a successful mission, keeping the replica operational rather than prolonging your own suffering may be preferable. <laughs> Do not eat your assistant.
Um, yep, just doing my maintenance checks. It's a small house plant. This is definitely all new. There's a sealed envelope among the documents. My god. It says classified replica information for assault officer eyes only. It's unopened. Not allowed to open this envelope. Probably contains some classified information about me. Open it anyway? Hell yeah. Elster. Replica known issues. Previous experience with this replica model has given us insight into it. Huh? Elster and Eunice were chosen for the Penrose program for their adaptability and reliability under long term isolation conditions. Stoic and reserved, Elster units have a relatively stable neural pattern. It is best for you to leave it alone and interact with the Elster unit as little as possible. Elster's neural pattern was a soldier of uh, Vincent origin, so their needs are basic. Boy, talk to the Elster unit about the war. Penrose vessels are fitted with specialized calibration pod, which may help with persona stabilization. To avoid resurfacing of Gestalt memories, do not show or give the Elster unit photographs, especially of soldiers during the war. Do not show the Elster unit movies or let it listen to music. Do not try to befriend the Elster unit. Ah, so... So saw the photograph. Don't know if I saw the movie. Probably listen to some music? There's 512. Got vehicle status monitor. In transit, location on course. Salt pilot. Actor, personnel. Active mess hall. Is this the mess hall? Alright, what else needs to be inspected? Bang Ariana has been working on recently, a serene coastline. Running out of ochre paint, Elster laughed when I told her. Now I have to mix it myself. So annoying. I still haven't read a whole bunch of these manuals. I feel like they gave me enough to read for the rest of my life. Most of them are boring technical manuals anyway. Could have given us more films to watch instead. Half of them are war films, which Elster doesn't like, and the other half are kitschy propaganda dramas. I'm waiting for everything to, like, snap back to reality. Ship's control panel. All systems nominal. Okay. So is that... Is that all of my maintenance checks? What else do I have? Port to Salt Scout Officer. And she is... in the locked room? Okay. Where did I say she was? In the... She said personnel. Salt officer, where are you? The ship is really big. I don't. Oh. Hey, Elster, you're up. Your bed is a mess. God. Miss you. Miss you too. Ah, uh, it's our 3,000 cycle anniversary. We'll be getting the updated mission parameters later, so I thought it'd be nice to celebrate. Wait, let me put on some music. <laughs> Don't let the Elster unit listen to music. Don't show it war photographs. Do not let it watch movies. Man, no wonder this one went crazy. It really faked me out with that ending. I feel like a lot of people could have just watched that and then quit and then been like, wow, I don't understand at all. Then again, I don't technically know if this uh going to add like a whole lot more or not.
Oh yeah, I do remember the numbers being called before. Okay, so got into a relationship with the pilot? You remember our promise. Well, now we're in the in rows, I guess. We better not have any things on here. Lost in our tooth. There was so much blood, my hands were shaking. Why is my hair falling out? I can't sleep. I just want to sleep. Please let me sleep. Hey, well, at least it gives me less to look through. I wonder why that one room was locked, or if that was the room you see in the beginning of the game. Oh, hey. Uh, a little something's growing in the hibernation chamber. Oh, fuck. Made a promise. Oh my god. I'll do anything. Damn. Compartmentalizing trauma. God, I wish I obtained what I needed. Huge match of flesh in the cryopod. That's alright, she probably wasn't using her arm and chesty anyways. Can't stop now. Keep going. Yeah. Ninety-nine hours to go. Oh. Hey. I recognize this beach. Those who sing the same song have heard it in their dreams. A dark tone at the edge of hearing. A silent voice whispering to my heart. Come join us. Together we will be eternal. There is no escape. We will be one. But I fear the dark sea that will swallow me. Guess I'm on to the other side of the beach now. Something old, far older than humanity, sleeps deep below the ground. Those of us who can hear its call in the night, an invitation. An ocean of memories where I ends and we begins. I wonder if this would uh, make a lot more sense if I actually knew the story of um, uh, Man in Yellow or whatever. Great holes secretly are digged where Earth's pores ought to suffice, and things have learnt to walk that ought to crawl. We should have never left the primordial soup. Only through death can I escape the call of the one who rules above all life. Why is this no different? Well, let me go out onto the boat. Kill me. Kill me, kill me, kill me. Dang, past the rocks. Oh. That's not snow. They all skulls. They all skulls. Hmm. All right, to the boat. To the ocean where we shall become one. Join the collective. Join the hive mind. Yeah. 
Go. Chapter three. Okay, okay, so so we, we still got some game. Oh, this place has gotten a lot worse. Something has changed. Yeah, this place has gotten a lot worse since I was left here. Bathroom stalls in various states of disrepair. Got nothing. I'll assume I don't need my shotgun anymore. Man, I don't want to go through all these flies. This is awful. This is disgusting. The door is blocked by a massive flesh. There's no way through. We got... Oh, thank God, everything I left in here is actually still here. Uh, okay, um, let's take... Ammo, rifle ammo, and flares. Do not... Oh, this is designed to be fired from a flare gun. Okay. Weird. I... Is that a real thing? I can't think of a flare gun that would fire out grenades like that. That's kind of wild to me. Uh, but sure. Sure, sure, sure. Okay, so no revolver ammo. I got two rifle shots. Or four, I guess. Ugh, I have grenades and flare shells. Okay, I'll go with the shotgun for now. I'm cool up the flashlight so I can actually see. All safe codes come to my attention for the protector of all safes. Any are to be interrogated until a corporal is found. It's Adler's note. Okay. You know, I was curious with the fake out ending. I was like, oh, begin. I was I can't load any of the old games. It just gets rid of them all. Together, together to victory over the Empire. We've been here before. Oh god, okay, it's been a while, hold on. Let's see if we can find the right page. Moon, sun, scales, rook, tree, sword. Do any of these <laughs> seem to match any of those? This is definitely just stars, I think. I mean, fuck it, we could try. Picking up some weird signals. Some real weird signals. Alright, well, that's clearly not gonna work. 
Unless the uh, default code's in there. I guess I could technically check. Wouldn't hurt anything. Classroom 4B? Okay. Well, I'm sure that'll be a mystery for another time. Shit. <sighs> Lucky. Nothing here. Well, it's making it easy on me for to walk around. Shit. Now eh, let's just blast them. What the fuck? Oh, you guys took so long to take out. Five shots or like four shots? Are you kidding me? It's all my ammo, man. What the fuck? Hell no. I think I'm gonna go grab some grenades, huh? That that seems like the smarter option right now. I want some grenades. Flare gun it is. Oh, that's not where the flare gun's at. All right, goodbye, shotgun. Hello, flare. That's a lot of ammo. And destroy inspect. Instantly explode on impact, killing or incapacitating almost anyone nearby. Not recommend to be used at close range. How do I reload this with shotgun shells? Or, uh, grenade shells, I mean. Not meant to be used for combat, can be used to set enemies on fire, incapacitating them and dealing a large amount of damage over time. There we go. Alright, now we got grenade shells. So don't know if I can pull this off. <sighs> Fuck, whatever. Good try, good try. Do not get up. Thank you. Alright, here it goes. Oh. What the hell did I just get hurt from? What the hell was that? Whatever. Classroom key? What do you mean? Okay. Clearly, I missed something. God, I'm gonna come back through that other hallway and. Oh, I forgot you guys weren't dead. Oh, do I actually heal a little bit to a certain point? Maybe not. Okay, so I need the classroom key. Where? Where? Guess here. Alright, what's the, um... What's the default code? Two zero four five twelve. Well, that actually worked. Man, if only I picked up that key in the beginning and uh 
Didn't have to take all that damage going back and forth. Real shame, that. Probably would have done pretty good. All right. Oh my god, another one? Yeah, sure, let's just keep jumping down the giant turmeric blood vessels. You've changed. It's like everything was taken apart and put back together by someone who doesn't understand how it works. Become whole again. Ugh. I wear no mask. And I hate everything. Perhaps this is hell. You keep giving me so much imagery to look at, and I'm just like, I don't know what I'm taking away from all this. And now, rot front. Like, am I... I, I assume I'm still the same character, right? And I'm not going through different ones. Hmm. Like I, I do be getting mind fucked right now, but I not understand not understanding the mind fucking. Hey Millimeter, oh god, you're giving me another gun? See, your requisition request for a Type 84 submachine gun successfully processed. Locksmith said it will take at least a period until a replacement key is done. My niece currently has the other key, but she's still at the hospital right now. To the lock or at Sector C, there are rumors that there's an Imperial spy active in your area. Protector Special Operations Unit has been dispatched from me on headquarters in the Met to investigate and should arrive within 6 to 12 cycles. Needless to say, should they be successful, this will not reflect well on your record. You know what to do. As every season, your performance will be subject to review by local command soon. Remember that this review will determine if you will be remarked or marked for a replacement. I understand that you need entry to the bookstore for your patrol, but we do not have a spare key for your front or for the front door. However, you can use the back entrance again to the store. It's secured with a keypad. Code is the birthday of my daughters. Note, they were born on Veneta. Check the last six digits of their PKZ numbers. Kind regards. No. No. Okay. Oh, thank God. Okay, let's, um, here. We'll put up player shells for now. Do I just switch to the submachine gun? Can you just repair patch? Let's try switching to submachine gun. See how that goes for us. Oops. So many guns. What the hell? Uh, 
Oh. Oh, I see. So, where I was before was... I, I haven't even been paying attention to this, but... I was at nowhere in the flesh pit, then this, and now I'm in rot front. I guess. <sighs> Probably can't make it past this without killing, right? Step on her, fuck. Well, good on me for wasting all that ammo. Great job. Guess I'm not gonna use the submachine gun. Grabbing the, uh,. I don't want to use the rifle yet. I kind of want the rifle for... I want the rifle for a boss. Yeah, we'll just go with grenade shells for now. If there's something that seems like it needs to die, then sure. Otherwise... Don't bother. Oh, cool. Uh. All right, note self. Watch out for tall brooms. Remember, you're never safe. Do I have map data? Oh, thank God. Thank God I have a map. Locked car's key. Doors of old room, 512. Double O now. Think tank. Is there even anything back? There's a door which could open. I might be able to bait them around. I don't actually know. Wait on that. Although. No, okay, never mind. Oh, here we go. Pop. Space. Shit. Shit. So much up here. <sighs> I guess I'll go find a room to dump shit off at. Go downstairs though. Ah. Ah. And I don't know why I did that. I was souping. Monfest celebrations cancel over safety concerns. Seasonal Monfest celebration, a young but well established traditions in most rock front sectors, will not be allowed to take place until further notice. The Protector Public Office has announced today. There is a credible threat to public safety that is currently under Protector investigation. Citizens can are only to leave home for work and report all suspicious activities to a block warden. Impressed about the rumors of an Imperial spy living in Sector C, the Protector Public Office only repeated their appeal to citizens to report all suspicious activities to a protector. Oh, that definitely paused time. Okay. We're waiting. Shit. Oh, she went around the bottom side of that. 
wonder if that means I could do that too. Yeah, maybe I can go around that. All right, I gotta, I gotta get my mind back into the survival aspect. I gotta really push for it. Okay, is that last door locked or what? No. Nope. Even though I know I should be going to... Ooh, painting from before. Excited there's a playing card and dead in the paint of the painting. Paint loader is too thick to remove the card without dissolving the paint first. I'm not gonna lie, I think that's bullshit. You, you can rip that thing out of there. Maybe we should thermite the shield. You know what? Yeah, let's let's thermite that one. The other two can come back, sure. I don't want the shield one to come back. Alright, um... Oh, I didn't even inspect this thing. Opening it right now will destroy the photograph inside. I need to add some developer fluid first. Well, that can be put up. Let's grab one thermite. Just because I have so much of it. In fact, if I keep saving my thermite, maybe in the next hallway I'll just go fucking crazy. hallway uh like next kind of area level chapter i'll just go nuts and i'll start burning everything <sighs> all right well with all this stuff i can only get one thing at a time what's that okay so she should be burnt don't have to worry about her again other two totally susceptible every time I come through here to be revived. <sighs> you know what? For the sake of inventory space, let's forego the extra grenade shells. We get one grenade shell. And I go to grab everything in the upstairs room. Oh, I guess there was also two ways I need to check. I think this wheel crank will be full. Dark apartment I'll deal with later. Okay, so give me that. Give me hand wheel and give me the rifle ammo. This unlocks from the other side. Okay. Should be able to get back downstairs, no problem. I'll worry about the dark room when I actually have to go through it. Uh, but I'll probably. Well, what if I use the flare gun to pop one of them? And then that way I can lead the other two around the room. That'd probably be the smart thing to do. Okay, rifle ammo. Revolver ammo. And wheel. Give me... Grenade shells. Oh, wait on the flare shells. So again, that shit's... That shit's valuable. That's a one-hit kill. That's good. I don't want to use that up. All 
Oh, well, that sure was a fun part of the building. What about over here? Oh, would you look at that? Oh, right, put that up. Okay, we'll get the hand wheel. Uh huh. <sighs> All right, this looks like a pretty... Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. It's gonna be pretty clear I have to fight my way through the area. Three replicas? No problem. Those are replicas are gonna get up real soon. As long as I don't go near them, I don't think they can get up just randomly. I think I have to go by them. And go. Perfect. Tone. We use this dissolve and clean up plastics, epoxies, and paints. The clean product uses soften and dissolve various paints and plastics. Ooh. Stun rod. You grind seems to be broken. It looks safe to drop through to the floor below. Up down? Fuck it, sure. Probably turn off this light though. Space to carry tower. Oh, we're getting some tarot cards in this as well. Billion Star of his Imperial Blockade continues. Due to the ongoing transit uh, kites. Uh, Russian shipments to Veneta have been disrupted by Imperial forces again. Millions of you sun citizens must starve for yet another month as Imperial missile frigates and uh, kits uh, orbit critically damage one of our humanitarian convoys on the way to Veneta, sending diplomatic efforts with the Empire into another crisis. <clears throat> The orbit of Kaitsa will continue to block free travel between Veneta, Rockfront, and Haymat for another eight seasons, which leaves our Liberation troops on Veneta stranded on the desolate ocean world with minimal support. Convoys will continue to be sent despite the Imperial blockade. Only through perseverance can we rebuild what remains of Veneta. Damn, there's a lot of good stuff in here. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Cool. We're good. Ugh. Lock for cars a key. That does not. Thank God that, uh, they blast took out two of them. I only popped one with it. Matrix code scanner. Oh, 
Oh, I got full inventory right now, so I gotta find a way to drop some stuff off. Oh, perfect. Well, let's take care of all this stuff. I think I need the extra... It's right now. You know what? And... You know what? Let's wait on grabbing the card because I have no clue it's for. And Unless I go that way, unless I have to worry about waking up everyone in the hallway. And considering I'm using grenades right now, I think it'd be really good to not, uh, I guess, piss everything off. And then have to waste more grenades. Good to skip. Yeah, so there's just going to be a lot of running around, grab items, and put it up. <sighs> I wasn't hurrying so much on inventory space. I'll definitely just take it all in. In fact, you know what? The stun prod, whatever. There. More space. Grab everything in that lunch room. So am I actually just I guess on right front? And am I I am still playing like The first character I was playing as, right? Or am I going through this replica's memories or something? I don't know. Okay, so. Tower. Millimeter ammo. And shotgun ammo. Some more. Millimeter. Can't get the rod. Alright, once I get back, I can choose uh, what weapon I want to try to move forward with. There's a better alternative. Does tower go in there? Let's see. Is that what this scanner's for? Is these cards? Okay. It's not. Where else do I have to go? End of the commercial corridor. And in dark apartment. Which again, those, those replicas are prone to get up any second now. So I'm gonna keep going to the right. Take the repair spray. Uh, so, pistol, I got five shots. Revolver, I've got a solid six. Shotgun. I got six. Might not be too bad with shotgun. What, it six or is only five? Damn, only five. Okay. Yep, I'm going shotgun. I need to clear space, I'll take one shot. 
should have saved. In fact, let's go back and do that. I've, I've walked around and grabbed way too much shit at this point. And not save. Alright, give me a second. I'm gonna take care of something. In fact, I might even go grab a drink. I'm kind of kind of thirsty. Man, good thing this game doesn't have to rely on a timer at all. Cannot believe how down to the wire I was with System Shock. <sighs> right, this room, okay. I could try to get around, but... Eh. Okay, locked. Ooh, also unlocked from the other side. Yikes, 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 yikes. Let me take him out. Nah. <sighs> okay, well. Down below. Oh, that's where I'm at. Down below. Ah, that's the metro platform I was thinking of. Oops. That leaves me with a good. Ooh, I have four shots left. Careful. Here we go. You know what? If needed. Oh, there's a save room right here. Patient key. Alright, let's put out the ammo and save. I think I've been sleeping on stun rods too much, huh? It is kind of an easy instant down. And then just stomp them. I feel like I like to use them in emergencies, but... I haven't really been allowing myself any emergencies. I think we'll use some of these. Ooh. All right, all right, all right. As long as this doesn't piss off the thing that's right there, but I'll probably just stun rod her. Gotcha. Idiot. Reunification at any cost. Orbital defense can battery. Veneta 12. We can concern our crosshairs. Right? This has been a lot of money. Ooh. Okay. Big room here. Is that more thermite? No way. Oh my god, this game is being so good to me right now.
Damn. I thought it was just gonna be Yule. Pareidolia. A resonance technology and its limitations. No other technology shaped our nation as by resonance has. Would we ever have been able to free ourselves from the stranglehold of the Empire without the support of replicas? Essential technologies like climaforming and induced gravity would be impossible without bioresonance technology. Despite that, it feels like we made a little effort to really understand or replicate bioresonant effects with conventional technology. Our progress in the development of electronics and microprocessors has stagnated for nearly a century now as we focus solely on new ways to instrumentalize this barely understood phenomenon. Take replica production, for example. The process of duplicating a neural pattern from a gestalt host to a replica brain is still not fully understood. How does synchronicity happen? Why is the duplicate imperfect? What happens to pre-existing patterns in the receiving brain? Recreating a replica purely with microprocessors and digital programming may be far out of reach, but I believe that we've become overly dependent on a poorly understood technology controlled solely by a few gifted individuals. It may not be long before we're back where we were under the Empire. Let's get out of here for a second. I want to see what else is here. God. Yep, we're just gonna waste these things now. Locked. Oh, okay. Okay, so that... Where is that? It's in the alley. And I have the patient key. Patient, patient. Blue hallway? Red Eye, there exists a strange folklorish idea in many sectors of Rockfront related to pareidolia, the tendency to see meaningful images in random patterns, like seeing a face in ink blot or letters in a smudge of dirt. It is well known that so called Red Eye is simply an anti cyclonic storm produced by a high pressure region in the atmosphere of Rockfront's planet. Yet for some of the early settlers of Rockfront, this natural phenomenon became symbolic of their struggle and way of life. That red spot in the sky became a perfect metaphor for the ever-present surveillance by the protectors and the tight grip of the central government on Haimat. Even today, the idea of an unblinking watchful eye observing their every move still resonates strongly with the people here. During the celebration of Monfest at the end of each season, adult citizens sometimes give students ration marks that have been dipped in red paint. Officially, the red paint is said to represent the blood of those who died in the revolution. But the red coins share an eerie resemblance to that red eye. Or is that just pareidolia, too? Did you ever receive one of these red-eye ration marks? Remember to clean off the paint with acetone or a similar paint thinner. Spending or re-gifting paint-covered coins is considered bearing bad luck. Okay, I guess that's the game's hint to be like, Hey, use acetone on the paint. Mind myself... Let's see if we can. Shit. God, 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 no! I can't go through that door, fuck! Oh, that was close. Going super gray after that. Shit. Oh, man. All right, well, I gotta shoot a shot and then possibly throw a mite someone. I'm gonna get that repair patch. Oh, God, no, you're so easy. I could thermite this thing. There. Easy, took one out. And the rest of the room should be navigable. Ah, oh, shit, there's not room to combine that. Okay, well, we're gonna need to take a shot of someone anyways. Oh, God. 
Unlock, unlock, unlock. Hospital hallway. Lock the door. Is that with the patient key? No. Nope. <sighs> so much to go through. Oh, for 512. So let's see, we're on floor... I don't know. God, there's so many items. Teacher's evaluation, area young. The girl without a doubt is remarkably odd, certainly due to her being raised solely by her mother rather than by a community of good people overseen by a block warren, as is normal these days. Her obsession with paintings, music, and other such nonsense was clearly in play during her time living in the mountains on that desolate radio outpost. And surely her friendship with those Vincent Boronitu sisters already also exposed her to some of the questionable literature that is illegally sold in their parents' bookstore. She does not seem to understand that these distractions are no longer acceptable now that she must partake in the society of our nation like anyone else. Personally, I can only hope the military service will beat those frivolous ideas out of her in a way that this school has failed to do so far. Should I pop the thing that's popping out of the ground? Oh my god. Why are you guys still here? Shouldn't you have reset? All right. Kill. 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 Ugh, annoying. All right, well, let's do this then. I'll take a repair spray. Cause boy, am I hurting. In fact, we'll take a second one, because boy, am I hurting. Okay, there's a lot of floor, or a lot of fours on this floor, so I'm guessing there's a... What's in the room is used down here. Oh, cool. Oh, that takes me down now. Um, okay. Well. I can drop off some more stuff, I guess. There is so much on this floor. Uh, I could take the acetone to the paint. We'll start keeping healing items, I guess. If it's not the Repair Spray Plus, I'm going to start keeping it in here. So that, that way I can just... You know, because if I have to heal... Uh... There's no real reason to do it in the moment, right? Alright, you know what? Let's go ahead and do the Acetone. Wait a second, though. I don't have to run past them, because I could. Let's go that way. I would like to see if there's a box up here, though, in the safe room. Oh, we'll wait on it. It's the best way to go up. It's like alley. Grinder will go down. Um, then there's the fire escape. Yeah, I'll run back that way. I don't remember, is this room real bad? If I actually burnt that or not. It's from the other side. Oh. Let's 
scary room, scary room. Okay, so butterflies, magpie box. Let's go past all this. Let's see what's down here. Oh shit! No. Oh. Crap. Oh, that I thought I had the sun prod. dark apartment. Yeah, okay. I don't want to really be in here. feel like it's easier to go through here. Eh, fuck it. Ugh, idiot, you want to put the stun prod? Moron. Some metal debris is caught in the light well's netting. Netting. Too weak to support my weight. It's supposed to like come from up above or something. Okay, um, let's grab acetone. Apparently there's no, um, it's not a single item box up here. And I get the cards for what, the scanner? Oh, I'm going to the computer store though. Up and out. part I never know how long it takes for them to get up we have a special stun rod in there I see hey okay, a stone please Key. Um, I guess that one would be good to run by there, anyways. Yeah, I don't want to really go into the atrium or the dark apartment, so forget that area. And the hospital hallway with the replicas under the tiles? No, 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 no. And pistol has five, revolver has a thing and a half, tons of flare shells, eight shells, six rifle shots in total. Ooh, good amount at eight millimeter. Starting to make me too powerful by giving me this many guns and ammo. So we want to go to the top floor. Very tippy top. Go through here. Run past these things and hope they don't wake up. Run past this area. Oh. Got that you actually were in that room. What? 
Let's see if this unlocks that door. There we go. What is this? Oh, this is for the cards. Okay. Oh. So I need six cards then? Dream Diary. Six night. I dreamt I was an Imperial Farmer. I embraced my lover in the red doses of kites. When a storm consumed us, the sand grinded us down until nothing remained. Seventh night, I was a worker in the mines of Ling, when I was consumed by a shapeless mass of flesh. My flesh joined the flesh of many others until only my bones remained. My mind joined the collective flesh, which persists beyond death. Sixteenth night, as a storm raged in the sky, I fell from a ruined skyscraper on Veneta. I never reached the ocean below. I kept falling when suddenly lightning struck the building and I woke up. Eighteenth night, I was floating in the sunless sea below the ice of rock front, and I saw a large creature move in the darkness below me in the moon's dark core. Nineteenth night, I saw a burning eye in the sky above the clouds of Bien. I was walking through the floating imperial palace when the gaze of the sun like iris burned my body ashes. Oh, I see. This tells you which... What thing the cards go with. So, tower... Would go... On skyscraper? I guess? Grab that other card. Give me that pick up lovers. And thankfully, from this floor, I should not have to go to the left of them ever again. So those guys won't wake up at all, if I can help it. So, lovers, huh? Yep, embrace my lover. Okay, so, kites. It's lovers. Well, this is interesting because I only have, um, oh, I use the diskettes with the computer in that save room. Okay, that's what I'm supposed to do. The next uh, save room. All right, let's get back down there. Is there anywhere I haven't been at this point? Or do I have the whole map? Keypad for that room. No clue what key for there. No clue what key for there. Okay, so I, I more or less have everything. Oops, forgot you were there. Down the garden street. Go see what I got on the disc. Also, no clue what uh, phases these things have to be at. So, give me... We can wait on the tower, honestly. I don't need to bring that card until I need all of them. Still need developing solution. It says patients archived. Just an office computers. Ah, see, here we go. Okay, so, Tina. What the hell? Rare frequency to 125? 10? Okay, let's see, 125.
This is probably important. I say, don't know what I'm trying to aim this at. <laughs> Wild. Alright, don't want to transmit this anywhere? Oh, magpie will probably need for something. Uses the power rationing on a lim no limited number of antennas in the greater power at a time to determine which antennas are currently powered. Use an antenna printer and triangulate the correct antenna. Take note of the antenna where the test signal can be heard on both dishes. In the transmit program, enter the antenna number and select the correct sound file to broadcast. Right, enough of that. Worry about that in a second. Gabriel, construction worker, retired. Chronic asthma, osteoporosis, severe hearing loss, sarcosinosis, cochlear implantation requested. Mm -hmm. Patient is forgetful about her medication. Is there anything needed here? React well to antibiotics. Very active in sporting activities. Yeah, the two sisters, they were in a note at some point. In the picture? Let's see. Regularly treated for small lesions, very prone to accidents. It was removed. Gale infection, unknown cause. Antidepressants. Seems to be unable to take part in communal morning exercises. Well, there she is. So are these all the people that the neural patterns are based off of? Is that supposed to be older and then is this the um the radio broadcasting one, because she's got the that stuff on her head. Be contact Kimmel, Colair tends to work. Hmm. Oh right, the PKZ things. Oh god, yeah, I gotta figure that out. I remember that note. That's for the keypad down below, I think. All right, so, 210. It seems like the kind of game where it's like, oh, did you, like, do you know that, like, 50 things you missed in Signalis. Seems like that kind of thing. Forty three. Is that what I'm looking for? Well, been sent to antenna. Is this changing the tune? Okay, so I guess I want to send Magpie and then I want to play this in front of the Magpie box. 
right? I can just play it on 210 or 125. Yeah, I guess that works. Okay, um, well... Do I need anything from here? Not... Really. Okay. Save and move on. So, first off, keypad. Wrong room. Keypad. Uh, it wasn't this one. Where the hell was that note at? It was talking about like, oh, like look at the PKZ number whatever of my daughter arrow table no. magpie oh i see there's a magpie and a butterflies thing although i don't know if the butterflies have to actually no, wait that was in the tomb right i don't remember i could head to the magpie box I don't remember where that one thing was. I'll have to find it. Oh, wait. <laughs> what am I saying? I get basically everything here. Uh. Let's see. Message inbox? Here we go. Warren Veneta, check the last six stitches there. PKZ numbers. E2, code's the birthday of my daughters. Okay, so for the bookstore. This is the back entrance, secured with the keypad. Is this for the bookstore? Six zero five two four. Damn it. Hitting all the wrong buttons. I six zero five two four. Glad I haven't had any other troubles with the keypads. Song of the Gods. Position distribution of the spell location is prohibited and punishable by the Fourth Cultural Protection Act. There exists a connection between all of us that few are fully aware of, a song that we all dance to but few can hear. This deep vibration of the cosmos can not just be heard and felt, we all resonate in harmony with it, shaping it, deforming it all around us. Uh, those select few who can consciously perceive it often fear it. Too oppressive is the sound of the stars, too invasive the noise of the unaware around them, polluting the song with their fickle emotions. Well, every once in a while, some are born that cannot only hear and play this music of the worlds, but who can conduct it. Gifted individuals capable of manipulating the essence of the world around them. You may believe that the Grand Empress is such a being. Her immense will bent humanity into the Empire of Yusen and lift us to the stars. It was her power that imbued life into the first and machine servants that now carry the weight of the Empire on their carbon steel backs. Okay. Uh, couldn't find her. Looked everywhere. 
just not here anymore. Can't go on. Sorry. You, you seem a little fucked up. Me too. Okay, you seem extremely fucked up, and you're rotting away in front of me. Like the f Damn. Alright, internet's being very bad. Uh, before it cuts out again, thank you everybody, okay, bye. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Sorry the internet was shit today. Hopefully I'll fix it soon. Uh, hope you all have a good rest of your day or night. Goodbye!